Blake Lively's cheeky sense of humor is leaving Wrexham fans in stitches. The Gossip Girl actress, who was on hand to support her husband Ryan Reynolds at Wrexham AFC's race course ground over the weekend, went viral when she stopped to greet spectators at the game and shocked the crowd when she jokingly gave one fan more than he bargained for. Can you say hi to Stephanie? It's my girlfriend. Hi, Stephanie. Thank you, you so much. You should leave him. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> the stands erupted in laughter after her quick-witted comment directed at Wrexham superfan Sam Neely. Blake was so lovely with the fans. Afterwards, she was signing stuff and she looked at me and said, I was joking, so that was nice. The candid moment comes as the 35-year-old and her husband stepped out for the first time with their newborn baby. Blake and Ryan took selfies with their little one prior to the Red Dragons game in Wales. Two of the couple's three daughters were also seen on the pitch with them. The duo clearly love being parents. In November 2022, the Deadpool star even had a piece of home with him at the American Cinematheque Awards. On the red carpet, he showed Access Hollywood's Scott Evans the meaningful jewelry he was wearing. I'm digging the suit. I'm digging the look, right? We stepped up, we stepped out tonight. I, I, if, you wouldn't, if you wouldn't mind, there's a bracelet on your arm I want to know a little bit more about well, this. My kids made yes. bracelets, I know, and I would, I would be foolish to not wear them, but I love yeah, my daughter spelled dad DVD, which I think is weirdly like a double entendre for my job. There you go. I guess. See? Brilliant. 12 years ago, but yeah. Ahead of her time. Right. Ahead of her time. Behind. Okay, well, I guess technically. Yeah, yeah. But, you okay. know, it all comes back. Yeah, it's not laser disc. I mean, that would be that something, would be so, good. yeah. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. iffy there. Um, the, the honor tonight, joining the likes of Clooney, McConaughey, you know what I mean? Would you have ever imagined at the beginning of your career that this would be the room, this would be the fraternity you'd belong to? You know what? I had the lowest of expectations for myself, <laughs> which actually kind of made all of this weirdly... Uh, digestible. I mean, my career was like very sort of slow. I was an aggregate. It wasn't something that was like meteoric. I was never somebody who had this overnight thing. Um, and I'm grateful for it. It's actually helped me keep my head screwed on right. Um, but no, I would never imagine something like this. Even after this event tonight, I will still never imagine something like this is going to happen.